Okay, yeah, hello and welcome to this video playing Grandmaster Mandragoro. Gerhard Schäbler, old friend of mine. So let's see what happens. We get, uh, I can actually do this. Does he still play, what does he play here? Sveshnikov, or what is he doing? There you go, he's going for the Sveshnikov. I think, doesn't he play queen a5? That's Check. what I remember, yeah, yeah. So. Check. I'm not going to make a draw here, that's not great. But I don't quite know how it is done, I think here, and then Check. I have to take. But it's not something that I really have studied. Queen g6 maybe, I, I really don't know. <laughs> This is uh, not yet something I've looked at. I don't know if this is good to be honest, but um, maybe I should have just castled. I mean, Bishop H3 wouldn't have been all that terrible. Then, yeah, okay, maybe I don't mind the queen trade here, I think. I don't want to take on, um, on G6, but still this, uh, like standoff here yeah, between the queens <laughs> doesn't look too bad. So just g3 or I don't know, is he going for d5 here maybe? Huh. Oh, maybe he is. c4 he can just take twice. But d5, but d5 I can also, I can just take, right? So, um, I could take now, maybe now, as the H file is of no relevance. Um, so, do I go C4 here or not? That was my original intention, so let's do it. Yeah, I'm not actually sure how I recapture. If he takes on c4, even bishop takes c4 makes some sense. Now taking on e6 is a little bit more interesting than before, as that would really harm his pawn structure quite considerably. But black can also play b4 in this position. I don't see anything wrong with this idea. Yeah, and now maybe just a5. Mm, okay. I oh, was yes, trying to regroup that. Um, however, this gives me the chance to play a3 now. Before it was a bit tricky because of potential takes in d5. This is now, this is now feasible. He might try bishop um, b6 to c5, but bishop b6. I can go b4. That's not not bad, probably. I don't know, maybe I would go a5 in this position, just prevent b4 and still have bishop b6, c5. a5 is, uh, yeah, that looks, that would probably be my main candidate. Now he's taking a while here. It's uh, not an easy, easy position to play. Or is this uh, some kind of connection issue? <laughs> I know, we're both connected. Uh, it's not an easy move. Bishop b6, it, it's not necessarily bad. 
Or is he going for something else entirely? It's a bit weird that this extremely long thing. Hmm. Hmm. What are you doing, Gerd? <laughs> no, there's something wrong. Maybe there was a doorbell or uh, I don't know, something that disturbed him. Yeah, so now a, a move at least. Um, yeah, I wanted to go before him and I will. So this one. Okay, and now I would of course like to put more pressure on the A-pawn, but that's currently currently not possible. Mm. Yeah, I would assume this is roughly equal. Yeah, he's got rook c8. I was thinking just this move, which basically trades, trades uh, down. I think he will probably take on b5, I mean. Yeah, bishop b6. Is he just blocking it? No. Yeah, I was thinking bishop e3 here to, to get this pawn rolling. From a structural point of view, this is pretty awful. A bishop b4 also, but then they have two hangs. So let's let's do it. Ah, oh, interesting. Um, bishop, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, moving the light squared bishop. Well, he cannot, he cannot take twice on e3. That's not going to work. So, maybe this is right. He's just too slow. If he takes twice as b6 and I'm promoting, he has to react now with a move like that. And now uh, I was thinking rook c1 maybe. Ah, it's actually attacking this. Okay. So. Hmm. I completely did not see that this is actually hanging on e4. Hmm. That's a shame. Time warning. Hmm. There's probably no way forward. Can I play bishop c4? Can take you there and I take here. I take on f7. Hmm. That is probably not not netting all that much. I don't know. Check. Check. Hmm. Check. 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 Yeah, it doesn't help. <laughs> Check. 
I have no way forward here. Yeah. Can I go bishop d1? I mean, I can, technically speaking. Bishop c2 doesn't help. Draw offered. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, is it a draw? Yeah, it might be, yeah. Draw offered. Game drawn. I see no way forward. And um, I really don't like to press uh, stuff like that on time against friends. So, hmm, tough. Huh? I felt like this should be somewhat critical. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, so let's uh, start somewhere, somewhere here and see what happened. This is, uh, I think, a normal theoretical position. Castles is probably more, more um, testing, I guess. But yeah, I don't, I don't know this line. So, and, uh, yeah, now I took and went C4. Yeah, this kind of structure is um, usually extremely sound and solid. And I think this is no no real exception. So we, we went here. And here I felt I could have something. And the engine agrees. But how exactly? Uh, knight e3. Aha. Uh -huh. Just not take it. Huh. Yeah, that, that makes some sense. Yeah, once you look at it. Yeah, and once the engine points it out, the knight here from here doesn't have any squares currently. Mm, not b3, c2, e2, f3, it doesn't, doesn't have many squares. And a6 remains weak. a5 is an interesting suggestion by the engine because this is probably not so great. Yeah, here I'm losing grip. Huh. Knight e3, yeah. And so this probably isn't uh, isn't all that great, but uh, the the main problem was like did this this and bishop e2. Hmm. I don't know if this is, is it, eh, this is a difference. Yeah, I actually have bishop f3 in some situations. I just wanted to yeah put the bishop on a safe square, but okay we had this this. Yeah, rook c1 was rook c1 was wrong. It was just a wrong move. Yeah, I have to. Yeah, this is better, right? Anticipate bishop b7. Ah, that would have been a lot stronger. Yeah, yeah, this is pretty good. This position uh, is pretty good. I'm not sure if. How does the engine just gives 0 0.8, but I don't quite see how black uh, stops the B pawn in the long run if I get my king involved. Hmm. Anyway, that looks very good for white. And oops, sorry. What I did, I just did not really have bishop B7 on the radar as a as a good move. And this is probably just a draw. Oh, there was one moment here. King f87 was even better for black, okay. Yeah, he didn't have much time. Check, check, check. Yeah, and check, here black is check, definitely active check, enough. I don't check, have any check. any great ideas, so a draw is uh, is fair here, I think. Yeah, okay guys, thanks for watching.